but yeah it's been a very crazy week morning Bye. everyone welcome back to my weekly vlog today is monday the 6th of june and it's my first wedding dress try on like we're going me and my mum are going to harrogate for the day um, and we're going to try on dresses obviously i feel a bit bittersweet because i'm really looking forward to it slash still really upset about bella if you lost last my watch my last week's vlog you'll have seen our dog died and um, so i'm still kind of like processing all of that but i'm really excited i feel just like bah. but anyway i'm gonna make the most of it and have the most lovely day with my mum we're gonna go for some lunch um and i decided to put the dress sort of day in this vlog because i'm not sure how much i'm even going to be able to film i was going to do a whole video on it but i don't know how much i'll be able to film inside of the dress shop um so yes potentially could have my wedding dress by the end of the day and yeah i don't know i'm it's horrible because i feel really excited but then in the same breath i'm like i feel all these emotions still off the weekend and what's been happening in the last few days so it's so hard and um, we well, were going to rearrange but we're both me and my mum both thought like it'll be a bit of a distraction for us and a lovely day together so i hope you enjoy the weekly vlog and let's go and hopefully pick a potential or my wedding dress so we're in the car and when i got in the car my grandma was meant to be coming and then she said she wasn't because she didn't feel very well and then she surprised us oh, <laughs> so that's made my morning and we're just on the way with mummy little madry <laughs> oh my god no, good job Nice oh. Alright, love you, bye. Me back. That's all. So we've just came at the IV for food and um smile you too. Mum, grandma. So we're having some food before going wedding dress shopping, which is gonna be lovely. I feel a bit calmer than I did when I left the house, so I'm very excited. I'm going arancini. Big ones. Truffle arancini. That's your lemon. Our little that pops. Go. Do you might want something in a minute? That was We're here. I'm very excited. I've got a nervous tummy. We're just waiting and having a little peppermint tea, and we're gonna get started. Because I thought you was going to turn that round. Slightly British look. Yes. We have little bits that make it look like... It does put your body in the video page. Look! Cheers, Pops. Cheers. Cheers. Woo! Perfect. <laughs> so, I got my dress. I don't think any of us expected it, to be honest. Um. And I tried a lot of different styles on and it was just kind of what I had in my vision I had actually picked it on the website of the shop I went to I'd picked it already and um, so I feel really excited and I think it's gonna be perfect for the location of the wedding and it's gonna look gorgeous when it's on so I'm very 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 excited I was just looking at the clips on the video of like some dresses i showed the vlog because they were so fine about us filming and stuff and it's crazy how you try things on and you just know they're not the one but when i put the one on i said to the lady quietly so my mum and my grandma couldn't hear i love it and i said that to her and she was like she loved it as well and i came out and these two loved it so i'm very excited i feel like it feels very surreal which i'm happy like i'm having an out of body experience but that's kind of what the last few days have felt like anyway so yes i'm very excited morning everyone 
today is tuesday and yesterday was my wedding dress shop and obviously i got my dress um the last clip i filmed was just explaining like a bit about it and stuff and basically when i was driving home in the car i was really panicking because i was like have i committed too early um and just kind of it was really overwhelming because it was the first shop i'd went to and sorry my eye looks black there i don't know what it is um and I was just panicking, but basically got home, spoke about it with my dad, Jake, and my mum. And every time I look at pictures of the dress, I'm obsessed with it. And they were like saying, well, cancel the order. And I was like, no, I didn't want to cancel the order. I think it was the commitment of, because it's still like, well, it's still like a year and two months away. And I was thinking, have I committed too early? Should I have tried more on? But I did in the shop try like eight, diff well, seven or eight different dresses. And they were all different styles. But the one I went for is like one I'd seen online a few weeks ago when I was looking at the place where I went yesterday. Um, so I knew I liked it. But when I tried it on, I did say to the girl, I love this. Um, and she really liked it. And then I came out, my mum and my grandma did. So I know I love it. It's just, I think I was quite overwhelmed with the emotion of like, did I rush into it? I know that I didn't because I felt away when I had it on and I know when I put it back on, I'll feel exactly the same way. And when I've looked at more photographs, actually it's crazy how it looks from the back and I really do love it. It's just, I was freaking out thinking, God, I've I've still got loads of time to look if I wanted to, but then as my dad said, if I kept looking, I would just make it even harder for myself because obviously there's so many dresses out there and I spoke to a few of my friends who have been married and they all said the same because it is a huge commitment. It's the biggest part of the day almost. But like, I feel so, I felt, I felt like, this is what I said, I felt like if I had to get married tomorrow in that dress, how I feel at the minute in my weight, my body, I could have done it. And I, I would have felt amazing but obviously like there's some of the dresses when they're like skin tight you'd have to be super like your best for them and I just didn't want to feel like that um obviously I know I am going to be dead healthy and up to the wedding I'll be so good because I've got my hen doing like the May and we'll get married in the August and stuff so I know I'll be super healthy it's just obviously such a huge commitment and I think oh um but i'm so excited about it i've been speaking with my friend today about it and my mum because she came over this morning and i love it i keep looking at the photos i've deleted the photos off my phone and um, but my mum had took loads and she got some really fab pictures um of like other dresses but i think i was also a bit sad yesterday because like i'd only done one shop like i could have made the most of it and gone to loads of different shops but i did commit yesterday and i don't think it's a bad thing because i did just know and i loved it and i i still love it and i can't wait to wear it can't wait to try it on there is just one thing i ordered it in the size i tried it on in but i know i will have lost weight by then because i'm not at like my best at the minute kind of i have put a bit of weight on and stuff so i, I do want to maybe get the smaller size because i know they said if it's like a drastic weight loss like it won't work but i know i'll probably just tone up so i just think if i go for the size down it'll be way more well it'll be better because i won't need as many alterations i don't know my head's kind of scrambled a bit with the sizing because it's super weird in wedding dresses um but yeah i tried about seven or eight styles on and there is some clips obviously you'll have seen them um but it's just crazy seeing yourself in a wedding dress when you've never tried one on um but it just makes it feel all so much more real now because that's a he that's the most a huge tick off the list um so i'm very excited and it's coming around so quick i actually really need to get on it with invites because in my wedding website which i'm doing so i need to really sort that out just ready for the like september october uh, august september time but yeah this vlog is a weekly vlog so that was a huge part of my week a huge part of my year yesterday picking my wedding dress i can't even believe it's real um but today like i said it's tuesday i'm still off work until thursday so i've got today and tomorrow which is lovely um today i've already seen my mum i've done my friend's nails because she's going on her holidays tomorrow and I'm just about to go meet one of my friends for a Starbucks. And we're just going to catch up, talk all things dresses. Um, but yeah, it's been a very crazy week. Like very big highs and very low lows. Which I think is probably also why I felt how I felt yesterday. Because 
I'd had such a low over the weekend and last week and then obviously yesterday was the biggest high the biggest and then a massive commitment so I was just yeah I think I'm just a bit all over the place at the minute but I'm very excited love 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 my dress I think people will be surprised at how simple it is which I think will look amazing with how I want my hair my makeup the flowers the venue oh! so yeah everything is happening and I'm gonna go for a Starbucks with my friend now and yeah, then we've got some food with some other friends tonight. We're just catching up with loads of people. Um, we're going to go for an Indian, which I'm I'm now very conscious that I want to make healthier choices because I'm getting married next year. I can't believe it. And I have to say, Jake and me and my mum and dad have all spent so much time together the last four days. And it's just been so nice, obviously in the worst circumstances, but it's been so nice. And Jake has been like my rock. He just keeps giving me cuddles. Obviously he always does, but it's just felt different because I've been emotional. But yes, little shout out for Jake. So let's go to Starbucks. Let's get a nice coffee, catch up with my friend and let's get on with my weekly vlog again. I hope you enjoyed yesterday's clips. I feel like it's hard because I was trying to be in the moment, but also was conscious of like filming little bits and stuff. So I hope we got a few snippets, but I haven't even looked at all the footage properly, but I'm sure we did. So yeah. I've been for a walk with my mum and I'm now gonna do a little spinning. Maybe like 25 minutes or something. Oh wow, I was super sweaty um, just listened to lots of ballads and cycled my heart out so that was good. I was very in my feelings in that cycle. A lot of emotions but it was good. So I'm all ready now and we're heading out for some Indian food. Also, look at that tan line. That was literally off sitting outside over the weekend with a gym top on. Got a little tan line. Um, but yeah, we're heading out for some food with some friends. I've had a really relaxing day, re well, relaxing slash productive. Um, the sun's just came out as well, so the weather's absolutely gorgeous. Um, me and my mum went for a walk before, like I said, and then I did a spin session, which I did vlog um, a little bit. And honestly, I was like, just getting all my emotions out. I was like happy, sad, I was singing, I had the door open, the neighbors probably thought, what is she doing? But yeah feel good for it so we're heading out and we're gonna go and eat some indian food i can't wait we're going to our favorite place um which i've been to a lot but i love it so yeah off we go and eat some good food and catch up with friends the top i'm wearing i actually forgot i had because i just forgot but basically my mum asked to borrow it a few weeks ago and i was like yeah i totally forgotten about that so she's worn it returned it to me and now I'm wearing it there's a little fly just getting out it's actually such a lovely night I was just saying to Jake it would have been a lovely night for um what do you call it pizzas out of the pizza oven morning everyone Today is Wednesday and I'm meeting up with some friends, um, my friend Gabby and my friend Cherry, I think I might have mentioned it in the vlog. Um, I'm so excited, they're actually coming around here so I'm just off to M&S now to get some snacks and some lunch for us all. Um, so I'm going to take you along and get some bits and bobs. I think I'm going to do like sandwiches, like salad -y bits, I'm very excited to see them. I've just got ready, waved my hair because it's needing a wash so I thought I'll get one more day out of it if I wave it. Done a bit of a crappy job, it looks very straight in parts, but hey ho. Um, and we had a lovely night last night at La Raj with our friends. We just had like a catch up, a few glasses of wine. Um, 
And it's funny because when I drink wine, not Prosecco wine, I don't wake up feeling horrible. Like if I've had a few glasses of Prosecco last night, I would have felt worse, but I had a few glasses of wine and some lovely food and I feel super nice. Um, I just tried my dress on as well for my friend's wedding in a few weeks time, which we're going to abroad and I love it because I've got a bit of color so it feels really nice. And I've tried it on with my makeup and hair, so I'm happy about that. Haven't done a spinning yet, but I think I'll get to do that this afternoon, which is good, because I need to just keep on that. But yeah, let's go to M&S and get some bits and bobs and some snacks. Also, how cute is the table looking? M&S haul. Hi everyone, welcome back to my weekly vlog. As you can tell, I'm sat in a car park. Um, I've just finished work and I'm meeting my friends after work for some food. Um, Rosie is home, one of my friends from London, so we're just all going out for um, like Pan-Asian food to the muddler in town, which is so good. Um, so I'm very, very excited for the food and obviously to see everyone, but I just came and waited for a bit in the car because um, they were on the way, so I'm just, sitting and i'm about to go and walk to meet them now but yeah i've been at work so i haven't really filmed much for the rest of the hadn't really filmed much before this clip but yeah i'm gonna go meet them for a fun little friday food all the f's but yeah let's go <laughs> Food overload. Just um, tag me, Demi. Yeah, if you don't mind. Me too. <laughs> Just get it for the vlog. No, you know. Last night when I got well, when my friends got to the restaurant, they got me this. How cute! 